A little further east on Interstate 84, one of ODOT's new efforts to improve traffic near Multnomah Falls malfunctioned today. A gate that's supposed to close when the parking lot's too full stopped working, then it led to a crash. Now, Jennifer Hoff went to get some answers about what happened exactly, and she joins us now. Jennifer? Jeff ODOT says it malfunctioned for the first time since the gate was put to work over Memorial Day. Multnomah Falls is Oregon's busiest natural attraction. Breathtaking. I mean, it's, it's awesome. Its parking lot, though, leaves a lot to be desired. If there's any type of congestion, we'll go down to the next exit and work our way back through. It's tough for tourists to find a spot in the lot, and drivers often back up on eastbound 84. ODOT's answer? A gate it installed three months ago. When the gate is closed, motorists know they need to move along. They can't stay and wait for the gate to open up. It reopens when at least 30 parking spots are free. Monday, on what was the busiest travel day in six years, the gate malfunctioned. Then, we were there when ODOT lowered it manually. One driver would crash right into it. I asked spokesperson Don Hamilton what went wrong. He said the agency is still investigating, and unlike some drivers, he supports the new safety tactic. Since these gates have been installed, it has been doing what was the original intention. The gate has been working the way that we had planned it to work, which is to say it activates when there is, uh, uh, gets full, when the parking lot gets full, and we get the notices out properly to the motorists out there so they know what's going on. I don't think the gates are a good idea. I don't think people backing up onto the freeway is a good idea either, but the gates, I'm just not sure that that's probably the answer. As for the driver, she wasn't hurt, but we're checking to see if she could be in any trouble while the crash serves as a good reminder for everyone else. It's kind of just cruise real slow and just wait for a spot to open up. As for ODOT, it says the eastbound exit lane has since reopened, and we asked when the gate will be working, and ODOT said by Saturday. Usually that's when the gate is working because that's a busy time of the week. And we'll keep checking and let you know what uh, ODOT says went wrong with that gate in the first place, Jeff.